This figure contains five identical squares and the distance from point B to point C is square root of 41 units. The two top squares are centered so that the midpoint of their bottom sides coincide with the vertices of these three squares. In other words, this point is right in the middle between these two points and the same is this one. We need to find the area of the entire figure. To find this area, first we need to find the side of one square. But how can we find one side if we only know that the distance from point B to point C is square root of 41? So what we will do, from point B we will draw a perpendicular down and we will form a right triangle. So here we have the right triangle and BC represents the hypotenuse. Now we need to establish the lengths of these two sides. We see that the bottom side is one side of a square, another side of a square, and a half. If we let this half be represented by x, then each of the other two sides will be 2x. And if we add them together, then the bottom side of this triangle will be 5x. Now let's take a look at the left side of this triangle. On this side, 2x plus another 2x makes a total of 4x. From here, to find x, we will use the Pythagorean theorem. That is, in a right triangle, one side squared plus another side squared equals the hypotenuse squared. So then, we will write the following equation. 5x squared plus 4x squared equals square root of 41 squared. Then, on the left side, 5x squared is 25x squared and 4x squared is 16x squared. Then on the right side, the square root and the second power will cancel each other and we will have 41. Now on the left side, 25x squared plus 16x squared is 41x squared equals 41. And if we divide both sides by 41, then we will get that x squared equals 1 or x equals 1. So we found x and x represents half of a side of a square. Then to find the whole side, we will multiply 1 by 2 and one side will be 2 units. Now to find the area of one square, we need to multiply 2 by 2 and 2 by 2 will be equal to 4 square units. Now, the figure has 5 squares, and the area of each one is 4 square units, and to find the area of the entire figure, we need to multiply 5 by 4. So then, the total area is 5 times 4, which makes 20 square units. I hope you liked this problem. Please subscribe, leave a comment and thank you for watching.